Okay, let's take a look at the MIDI and virtual instrument side of New Window 10. Under Studio, Studio Setup, if you look at the MIDI port setup, you can see I have a Nuage system connected, but you can add, uh, let's say, if I, have, if I had a Yamaha DM2000, for example, I could just uh, add this device in here and then select my inputs, MIDI inputs, MIDI outputs directly from here. I can also remove it. You can add it automatically in here um, or simply remove and go back to my initial setup. To add a keyboard, um, you go to Studio, More Options, MIDI Device Manager. In there, same uh, setup, you would install a device. Uh, so here you have a list of different keyboard manufacturers. Uh, if I look at, um, let's go for Yamaha Motif. I can just add Yamaha Motif to the selection. So I can just select an outputs, and I'm pretty much ready to go. A lot of keyboards these days are USB, so it's uh, pretty much plug and play. To find out if your MIDI connection works, uh, if you go to the setup here on the upper corner, you can uh, I can show the transport bar in here, and uh, make sure you have you input output activity, which allows you to, to see the audio, but also the MIDI output acti activity. So you can see if uh, your MIDI device is connected properly and uh, uh, showing an output activity from there. If I uh, output the uh, show the left zone with the inspector, um, you have your inputs, outputs here for an audio track. You'll have the same thing for MIDI. So if I create, uh, let's create an, a MIDI track here. So let's just say this is a MIDI track, or MIDI one, and maybe we, uh, let's just create two of those. I can just add track. And my MIDI tracks in here, you can see MIDI one and two. So if you look at the inspector side, just like an audio uh, sections, you have you input MIDI, so it says all input MIDI, so you can have maybe multiple keyboards connected and be able to hear them all. Uh, for virtual instruments, you can, of course, create a virtual instrument from here by just say, hey, I'm going to, you have a list of virtual instruments available, comes with new window 10. And let's just say you can just uh, select uh, aliens and just say just one and just add track and it will just automatically create an alien tracks with again inputs outputs activated midi and in here you'll be able to select a preset for the selected virtual instrument now another way to bring in uh, a virtual instrument is to use the left zone so if you go to the left zone here you have a little house so if you go home you can actually just click on virtual instruments. It will give you a list of uh, all virtual instruments you have within your system. And you can just drag the virtual instrument icon directly on the track. It will create a virtual instrument track and open the uh, virtual instrument editor.